GH Dog TV, your number one TV for all dog lovers. My name is Richie from Richie's Kennel. Keep on watching GH Dog TV. Stay tuned. Greetings, my name is Solo One. You can call me the dog blogger, and this is GH Dog TV on number one dog TV for all dog lovers. In case this is your first time of bumping into our channel, you just kindly subscribe to our channel and then you hit on the notification bell icon for more exclusive and amazing dog content. You can also follow us on all of our social media handles on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter at GH Dog Blogger, and also log on to our official website at www.ghdogblogger.com. Um, last month we were at Takrade for the SAPS and BBAG Boabo appraisal. And as I'm speaking to you right now, I'm in Accra, yes, Accra, the Ifwa Sutherland Children's Park. That's the location for today. And today we are having Accra's edition of the Boabo appraisal. So there are lots of Boabo owners, Boabo breeders, lots of Boabos right here. So we are going to check all of them out and we are also going to get interactive with some of the Boabo owners readers and the people right here so don't go anywhere stick and stay as we bring to you more exclusive dog content from this boa bowl appraisal my name is solo one you can call me the dog blogger Okay, so I'm still at the A4 Sutherland Children's Park and I'm sure you're loving the scenes right here. Lots of boobos right here. I'm right here with this boss man, with these beautiful boobos. Boss, welcome to the show. Thank you and good afternoon. 
to your listeners and your viewers. My name is Obeda Samoa. I'm a partner at OB Kennel. We can be found in Spintex, so that's what we are doing. We do pure breed baubles that are straight from South Africa. Um, they are pedigree, so they come with their certificates, they are microchipped, and we make sure that we breed with only dogs that are pedigree dogs. So that is what we do. Wow, that's beautiful, that's beautiful, that's beautiful. I think um, last year at the Boabola Praise, I met with um, another boss man of um, Obi. Yes, yes, he's, 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 he's the main head okay. and I'm his partner. So I'm just here to partner him. So last year we were here, um, our dog was the second highest appraised. Wow. That's hashtag Lucilla, she's a female. And this year we are here with another set and we hope we are able to clock something beautiful. Today, yes, we, are, yes. today, we, are not, today we are not here for competition, we are just here to just, just appraise our dogs and, and move forward. That's why we're here. Okay, that's nice. I remember hashtag Lucilla very well when I spoke with OB. Lovely viewers, that's OB Kennel right here. And I'd like you to say something about um, these lovely dogs. Tell my viewers, I know most definitely somebody wants to know the name of this dog and all of that. Can you tell us something about this dog? So this black male is Groot Lumberjack. Groot Lumberjack is, was gotten from a kennel in Accra here by the name Groot. Um, he's, he's an offspring of the late Absolute Emperor. He's passed. And his mother is Absolute Tia. And she is from Mabi's Kennel. Mabi is a popular kennel in Ghana. He has bred for a very long time. He's a good friend of ours. And we got this lovely female from here. Um, Mabi's daughter is a daughter of Absolute Vice. He's a legend. Everybody that has been breeding or has been following Boabos for a very long time knows Vice. And that's his daughter. And she's Vice's daughter with Africa Candice. Yes. Nice one, lovely viewers. Let, 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 let's check them all out. But before I let you raise them up so that my lovely viewers can have a clear look of, of them, how do you see today's Wobble appraisal? Um, today's Wobble appraisal has been good. Um, a lot of dogs have come. There's a, there's, we advertised well. We did well in Takrade. And we hope we overthrow them because in Takrade there was um, Stefano Grand Slam that got 84.8. And hopefully we're able to just beat it. Even if we get 84.9, we are good. We are good in Accra because we want the title to stay here. Last year it was Rugby Goldberg and this year we still want to keep the title in Accra. So that is what we are trying to do here. So that's why we are here. It was a good turnout. A lot of people came here. Um, a lot of dogs, very well comported. People have, have ensured that their dogs are, have done the right thing. That is, they are all microchipped. They all have their DNA. They have been profiled. And we're here to do a pleasure so we can produce pedigree purpose to supply the market. So that's why we are here. So we are here, we are interacting with ourselves. Um, you know, so, some of the dogs, you may have heard them, you don't know them, there's a chance to meet them. We talk to um, the individual owners. And some of us are even planning breeding as we are here. So if your female is on heat and there's a meal you like here, you can talk to the person, have a discussion, and, and see the way forward. So that's what we are doing here. So that's what we are doing here. Thanks for having you on the show, sir. Nice one. Now, lovely viewers, let's check them all out. Let's check them all out.
Okay, lovely viewers. I'm right here with the boss man himself of OB Kennel. The last time I think you mentioned that the full name of the um, the OB is Obibini Kennel. Yes, yes, please. Yes, yes. So if my lovely viewers are some people who have been following um, our coverage or they'll notice that last year you were here. So how did it go last year? Okay, so last year was okay. I think the attendance this year is better off than last year. Uh, even though this year we have already had one first appraisal at Takrade, so the attendance is very encouraging. And they are better nice dogs this year than last year. Yeah. I'm sure you might have seen the video of um, the dogs in Takrade, even though you were not there. As compared to Akra, how they were saying that the best was from the west when I got there. But from what you've seen around here, how would you put it, looking at them? Yes, yeah, so there were a couple of dogs. I think the dogs from uh, Tadi were really nice. Uh, but looking at Accra, Accra is Accra. I think Accra is the hub of all the Wabus and everything we have. Even some dogs are in that, uh, because of Zoom, they can't do reappraisal. And you could see that if those dogs are to be appraised, they will be better off getting 85 and above. Yeah, so they are nice dogs. Yeah. I, I, I spoke to your partner and he has already introduced these dogs. So then um, let me ask you this final question. How do you see today's Boabula appraisal? Oh, it, it has been organized well. I think the weather has also helped. The sun is not really high compared to previous days. We were seeing that the sun were really high. But it looks like the sun is really down and then it's been organized better. I think most of the dogs have... They have trained them looking at the previous things that have happened. They've learned from what has happened in the previous appraisal and they've come very much prepared. So that's what I'm saying. This year has been much, uh, breeders came in much prepared than the previous years. Yeah. CEO of Backyard Kennels. Backyard Kennels. Back as in back with a K. Yeah. B A R K. Backyard. Okay, okay, okay. And where, where are you based? We are based at Pidiasse. Yeah. That's nice. Um, let me first ask you how do, how do you see today's Wobble appraisal? Oh, it's been encouraging. There's been 23 dogs. So far, we've had about 15 appraised dogs. And it's going on well. The turnout has been very good. Very, very good. 
beautiful. And you're right here with this solid boy. It's a boy, right? Emil. Yeah, that's that's Mabis Magnum. He's 14 months now. And he's from Mabis Boabos out of Middle Post Bogum and Elevation Lily. Yeah. And I think I, I met his little mate in Takrade. That's Bucho, right? Yeah, Mabis Bucho, yeah. Yeah, that's him. So what? So what, what do you like about this dog here as well? Magnum is a lovely dog, very aggressive at home. But he comports himself when out. He's very lovely. He likes girls. No two ways about it. He really likes girls. He's a very lovely dog. Very, very loyal and very, very obedient. Yeah. Nice one, boys. Now let's check this beautiful dog out. Lovely viewers. Let's check out this beautiful dog right here. Right here. This is Ransford, Ransford Jogger Crew, okay. and then I'm, I'm the CEO of Marshall Kennel. Yeah. Marshall Kennel meaning Mastiffs and Rottweilers. So our main focus are then the South African Mastiffs and then the Rottweilers, that's what we do. Nice one. You didn't mention the part that you're, you're, you're mostly known as Ranzi. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm mostly known as Ranzi, like everywhere, everyone knows Ranzi. I'm sure even people don't know I'm called Ransford. <laughs> but, uh, from afar, I thought you were just into Rottweilers. Oh, no. Okay, I started, actually, I started with... My first, 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 first dog was um, a Boabu mixed with a Rottweiler. Okay, so that was when the love started. And then I got a Rottweiler. And then after some time, let's see, somewhere around 2016, and I started with the Rottweiler. I've also bred Boomasis before, but I lost her. So I, I, I focused on the Rottweilers. And then somewhere, just last year, 20, uh, 2020, 2019, 2020, and I decided to try with the Boabus too. It's going well, so now we are doing bubbles and water wireless. Nice one. That's the boss of Mass Rot Kendo right there. And he has this lovely boy. And before I, I, I leave you to attend to other matters, can you tell us something about this beautiful boy right here? Um, this is Guantamani Zik. And then he came to us last last year. Yeah, last year. He, he just turned two years. He's still young. He's one of the three stars at uh, Mass Rot Kendo. And we were coming for reappraisal. We didn't read, not knowing there was no reappraisal on Zoom Dogs. But his appraisal score is 84.5. That was when he was 11 months. Yeah. Lovely viewers, let, 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 let's check out this beautiful boy right here.
My name is Henry Boateng. Uh, this is Terrible Twins Knox. He's 18 months. Uh, he turned 18 months uh, on the 4th of uh, June. Yeah. And we are here to participate uh, in the current appraisal organized by BBAG. Yeah. Are you just a dog owner or you're also a breeder? You breed them as well? I'm a dog owner. I've not registered to, uh, to breed yet. Yes. But, so currently, you can call me an enthusiast. Yeah. <laughs> you have other boobos as well. Yeah, I have other boobos. I have uh, Baddington Jack, um, and then I have uh, Heinemann uh, Tina. Yeah. So hopefully I'll be breeding her to to Knox uh, after the appraisal. Yes. Nice one. So you come in here with your dog. How do, how do you see today's dog appraisal? Well, yeah, the, the activity today it's it's been nice. Um, the organizers they've done well. I've uh, seen a lot of very nice dogs, both male and female dogs, yeah. The event has been nice, yeah. Made a lot of friends, seen a lot of people here, so the event has been nice. Nice one, sir. Thanks for having you on the show, sir. Now, lovely viewers, let's check out this beautiful bobo right here, solid boy right here. Let's check him out, let's check him out. I'm Akwesi, Akwesi Befi. Yeah, I'm here with Obin Boabu. Yeah. Hi. Osman, you're the boss of Obin Boabu. Exactly, exactly. My name is Josiah Obin, and I am the boss of Obin Boabu. I've been following you on, on Instagram, and I've, I've been seeing some beautiful Boabus right there. Yeah, yeah. Um, we, we are doing our best. We are doing our so best. Into just Boabus, just as. Yes, um, I am a Boabu aficionado. That's my focus. That's the only thing that, you know, takes my fancy, so. <laughs> nice one. So coming here um, for the Boa Bola, is, is this your first time at an appraisal? No, no, no. Um, I'm actually one of, part of those who put it together. So um, every year, I actually, it's one of the things I look forward to um, as a breeder because it, it's almost like that opportunity to see what we have been doing over the year and then put our dogs on the scale to see whether we are improving or which we So I always look forward to it on the calendar every year. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. So um, if somebody is home who has, um, let's say, dog but hasn't yet appraised them what, what word of advice can you give to them so i would, I would advise them to um, take these opportunities seriously because um, one it helps you to understand the strengths and weaknesses of your dog um, most people just pick a male pick a female put them together and kind of churn out puppies what they call puppy meal but if you know what you are doing you need to understand the strength of your male and then the females you pick to complement that male so that you improve the breed at the end of the day um, the whole essence of breeding is to improve the breed and so it is in such avenues that you get to have first and you know interactions with judges to know that okay the head is good or the hind needs improvement and whatnot so I would encourage anybody at home with um, a wabu to take advantage of these opportunities Nice one, nice one. That's coming from the boss of Obin Boabus. Now you have this fine dog right here. Can you tell my lovely viewers about this dog? Right, so um, this here is um, Kadima Renishade. He is from Becca Fanus and Megazone Alejandra. He's just 18 months and um, we, are, we are planning to use him extensively this year. And so in order to do that, we need to have him appraised. And then, so that's why we are here. He's a fine boy. One of the things I love about him personally is his head. Um, his head is that quintessential Boabu head. So uh, he, he's a really nice boy. He's a nice boy. Lovely viewers, just take a look at the head that um, the boss man of Obin Boabus was say. And where did you get him from as well? So um, he was actually bred by um, Kadima Boabus in South Africa, but I got him through Bostu Boabus. So Bostu bought him as a puppy from Kadima, and then I obtained him from Bostu when he was around eight months, and then I raised him to this this point. Yes. Nice one, boss. Thanks for having you on the show, sir. Very much. Thank you very much. It's been a pleasure. Lovely viewers, now let's check out this beautiful dog right here. This beautiful dog right here.
I'm Abigail Agdell. You're just a dog owner, you're, or you also breed as well? I'm just a dog owner. Okay, okay, okay. So how do you see today's event? Um, it was exciting being able to interact with other dog breeders and stuff. So it was really exciting. So this is your first time at the Boa Bola Preza? Yes, please. I see you with this lovely boy right here. Can you tell us something about this dog? Okay, he's very protective. Can you tell us something about the name and everything? Okay, he's grey. And then we have um, Nacho and then Monique too. Alright. GH Dog TV, your number one TV for all dog lovers.